Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video by me, JK. Are you subscribed to the channel? If you haven't, please, please, please do subscribe if you enjoy my content. I would really love it if you would join the family and become part of the JK family. We have a good time here. It's a mix here. It's a vibe here. We have a good time. We're friends. We enjoy each other. Please do join the family. You can have a good time here. Thank you so much for being here. And today's that day where I'm filming some of my favorite videos of the year to film, which are my top 10 or top favorites of uh, lifestyle, beauty, books, whatever. So I'm filming some of my favorite content today. And right now, right at that, that's about now. What I am filming is my favorite lifestyle uh, bits and pieces for 2021. So we're going to get into the video. There's a lot of stuff. There's planners. There's food bits. There's um, shoes. There's alcohol. There's a bunch of things. So definitely these are the things that got me through 2021. 2021. And the first ones is this. How about that? The blog hataka. Like, let's get into the video. <laughs> so the first ones are my blockers. These are my sunglasses. I love these. Ever since I picked these up from Eldo, because I couldn't, my sister refuses to return my Zara ones, which I absolutely love. These ones are very, very similar to uh, the Zara ones, and they're sort of like a, a cat eye a little bit, but it's also, they're blockers, they're big, they cover up the face, and I really, really love these, these are from Aldo, ever since I got these, I've neglected all my other sunglasses, it's actually a travesty, it's actually quite shocking, it's quite depressing, but I really, really love these, Aldo does some great sunnies, especially in the summer and spring months, you need to check it out, it does the absolute most. Uh, my everyday sunglasses are typically either from Aldo or they're from Zara or Aldo or Zara, pretty much. And these are my first lifestyle favorites. I really, really love these. Been wearing them all the time. I wear them in my snaps on Instagram. You know this. If you follow me, you know this. And if you're not following me on Instagram, please do that while we wait. Thanks. Thanks. Elevator music. Do the next faves of mine that you've probably seen in my videos are these two. Recently, more so this one, which is, uh, these are both from Typo and these are tumblers that I absolutely love. This is a 700 mil and this one is more of a 500 mil because it does have the film on the inside that keeps cold drinks cold and hot drinks hot for a little bit, um, but this one is slightly bigger. I absolutely love them, why? Because they're black, um, but it's great for somebody like me who drinks water all the time. This one does have water in it. For somebody like me who drinks water all the time, to always carry around a tumbler with me. When I leave the house, I put some lemon slices in there, put water, lots of ice, and I leave. And everywhere I get, I'm just like, could you just, could you just pour me some water, please? And then they pour me water and I drink my water that way instead of having to lug a big uh, one liter water bottle. Even though I do love those too, but these ones are just more me to carry out on the streets, you know what I'm saying? And Typo has really, really great tumblers that you should definitely look out for. Not only Typo, I think... Um, Cotton On does some nice ones as well. I just really love the type of ones because they're sturdy, they're great, they look great. And yeah, some of them are loud, but some of them are actually quite just subtle and simple. And that's more me. That's more me. That is more my vibe. You know what I'm saying? Catch me outside. How about that? Her, these. Now, if you follow me, you know. I don't even want to, like, here's the thing. I don't ever want to come to you guys and lie about things that I like or things that I don't like and show you things that you've never before seen on my channel. And then here I am, I am saying that, oh my God, these are my favorites. Really? But that time you've never seen them on my channel. I'm not that girl. I'm not going to do that to you guys. So you guys know because you've seen me speak about these. You've seen me show you these. You've probably seen me walk in these in my vlogs and all of that. I, it's not very often that I'm going out and I'm wearing heels and whatever. So on all the other days, I am wearing my on the cloud sneakers. So these might be slightly dirty, but I just want you to see the sneaker. 
<laughs> some lady actually stopped me when I was in Westpac the other day and she was like, sorry, but those sneakers look very, very comfortable, are they? I'm like, aha, uh -huh. yeah, girl, they are. They're really, really comfortable. And then I had to tell her where she could go and get them and she was like, yo, on her off day, she's gonna go and get them because they look really comfortable. I love these. I've got three pairs of these that I absolutely love. The other pair, I haven't shown. I just recently got them, so I haven't shown yet. You'll probably see it on my Instagram sometime. But I've got black, white, and another pair. And I absolutely love them. No shoelaces, nothing. You just slide your foot in there and it's great. And not only that, they're comfortable. Try these. I ain't even finna lie. They've got running shoes, running versions for people who run long distance, marathon runners and all of that. And then they've got these ones, which I think they call the freestyle range or freestyle for every day. These are so good. So, 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 so good. My father has like 20 pairs of those sneakers. It's wild. My headphones. You guys know that I love JBL anything in terms of sound. I've got the speaker in the house. I've got the headphones, the, the wireless ones. I've got the pink ones, which have the wire. I've got the, the ones that you stick in your earphones as well. I'm a very big JBL fan in terms of sound because I feel like it's just really um, affordable. It's good quality and it's not affordable, but it's not ridiculously expensive for something that's going to last you forever and ever. So I used to use these at the gym, but even when I haven't been to the gym, I'm going back to the gym in the new year. But even with that said, even at home, if I'm sitting and I'm listening to music or I'm sitting on my blue couch there reading and I want to listen to uh, uh, reading sounds, great, great. Noise cancellation, really, really good. Like you can't hear a damn thing when you've got these on. And they're comfortable, they're great. Black on black, leather. How do I not love them, sweetie? Mm -mm. They're really, really pretty. Really, really, really pretty. I absolutely love these. Love them. Are we going to even need to talk about this? Are we going to need to talk about this? Do we need to talk about Sam Young? Do we need to even talk about Sam Young? No. Uh, Sam Young was brought onto uh, the scene, onto the trendy scene with the spicy, three times spicy noodle challenge. Yep. But Sam Young actually has many other variations of their noodles. They've got the low calorie ones. They've got these ones, which are the hot chicken flavor. These ones are also hot chicken flavor, but it's a different kind. One is, this one is halal. How great is that? This one is halal. And this one is a different kind of chicken flavor kind. There's something in here that's weird, feels weird. But they're really, really good on days where I typically make meat only on certain days where I just feel like I just want meat. I don't want to have to make rice or wheat or whatever. I just want meat. And then after I make the meat, I'm like, oh, but I want something else to add to it. And then I'll just get these and put them in there with a little bit of spring onion, a little bit of tomatoes, a little bit, sometimes I'll add an egg on there to make it very Asian, you know what I'm saying? But easy, quick, three minutes, you're done. That's all you need. So these are great for the days where I do not feel like cooking and I just wanna just do something real quick and not worry about anything else. I absolutely love, love love these and something that i do love to snack on these days and my partner calls me olivia pope because i snack on these with wine mm. it's hard for you to see what they are because these are microwave popcorn this is from act 22 my favorite is act 22 or stay kinoko i typically don't like the woolies ones something about the woolies ones that just something about that butter taste them some some just doesn't doesn't you know catch me outside right no no it's fine uh i really love popcorn i'm trying to stay away from chips i haven't had uh chips in a really long time like the lays american barbecue flavored chips cha i haven't had that in it's probably going on three months now i haven't had that in a while because they ravaged my body charles <laughs> okay so I really love to snack on popcorn and I love to snack on popcorn with Astros, the sweet and the um, sweet and salty. <gasps> so I don't have popcorn all the time, but when I do, like maybe that once a week or whatever, I'll do a bowl of popcorn and I'll sprinkle on some Astros and have that with some wine. Child, I 
talk about romanticizing your life, honey. Love, love, love. So I just wanted to show you the pack because I wasn't going to warm them up and whatever. I've got things to do today, child. So I don't, I can't. I can't. In terms of the home, I've noticed that I've kind of digressed from candles a little bit because I spend so much of my time burning pillar candles that I don't really buy candles candles anymore like fancy candles like the charlotte race ones or the joe malone's ones or whatever whatever i don't buy fancy candles anymore because i've switched to diffusers and i feel like it's more bang for your buck i've had this diffuser there's a little tiny bit of it left i need to open the other one tomorrow i've got a few in the house but i've had this diffuser for about five months and it's only now gotten to that little tiny bit left and these are from at home and this is from the at home range it's got calm dream uh whisper and i don't know what but my favorite ones are calm and dream and i think this goes for about 600 bucks it is there's no size thing but it's fairly big for a diffuser that's why it lasted me about five months really really good i wanted to open the new diffusers in the new year so that I know, you know, around June or something, then I'd have to replace them. But they're really great and they make the house just smell so fresh. These ones are more oil than water. That is why diffusers tend to last much longer. If there's a bit more water in them than oil, they tend to quickly and depend. But then when there's more oil, you can actually gauge that by the one of the ladies showed me you can gauge it by actually touching the reed stick and then feeling it and see it seeing it on your between your fingers if it feels a lot more oily than it does watery it's bound to last a much longer time there's a tip there's a tip i got you so when they have them in the store there and they have them on show so you can smell them actually put your finger against one of the reeds and then look at it and then feel it between your fingers like this if it feels a lot more oily than it does watery it's bound to last a lot longer if it feels a lot more watery don't buy it it's gonna last you a month or two and then that's it cash me outside and then next out are my planners now i am a planner snob and I think if you're South African and you follow me, you might know this planner. Okay. It's a little bit dirty, but it's a great planner and I can't wait to get the 2022 one. I have to buy it like tomorrow or something. This is the boss plus one, um, daily planners, uh, yearly planners it's for right throughout the year. And they are great because they are often themed and they've got little, um, what do you call this? markers can you see that they've got little markers on the end there and there's things like health goals business goals personal goals finance goals and then you move from um from all the the months of the year you know you've got january february blah blah, blah. i've got things written on there so I'm not gonna, <laughs> we're not gonna do that we're not gonna do that but they are great this one was one of my favorite ones this year i am very much organized and I feel like when I'm not organized, I feel like I'm going out of my mind. So I really, really like planners. And this one is for my daily affairs, sure. And then there's uh, planners that I have for extra, extra um, side projects, side things. Just got Leo, her story. There's planners that I have for certain things like that. This is for daily affairs, like daily to-do list, daily what, what. I need to remember to go pick up this. I need to remember to sort out this about this account. I need to remember to go call this, this. These are for, for uh, long-term and short-term goals for my side things. So these JK, her story, and they're always there and I have them with me. And these ones often go right into the next year as well. If I don't fill it up, I'll use it right into the next year as well. And I love these. These are uh, the My Notebook range from Ligami Milano. And they're really, really pretty. They're really, really pretty. And I love the, the, the color blocking in, sense in the, what do you call this? This thing that holds the sleeves together. They're really great and it's like almost like a really soft leather. So, so lovely. So lovely. Love them. They're not the cheapest. That's probably why, but they're lovely. That I use a lot and I think you guys know this. 
You guys know this. You guys know this. Something that I use a lot, a lot, a lot, and you've seen me in my vlogs and my videos, my AirPods. My AirPods come in clutch. Okay, when I'm in different parts of the house and my phone is over there or when I'm da 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 or when I'm listening to music outside on my balcony every evening I go outside and I listen to music and I have a glass of water or a cup of tea uh, when the weather allows and it's nice and warm and balmy and I'll sit outside for an hour and I stick my AirPods in there and I'll listen to music. My AirPods have become my best friend. I carry them with me everywhere. When I'm in the mall, when I'm sitting at a cafe, reading a book, they're in there. You know, so definitely some of my lifestyle favorites for 2021. Lovely. Lastly, it's going to be alcohol. <laughs> Are you surprised? Because I know I'm not. Ah, first one. Lastly is alcohol. I've become a really big fan of red, but this particular red. Now you guys know if you follow my channel, again, a lot. If you're not subscribed, please do that now. Thank you. Um, you know that I love the Springfield wines and I love the work of time is one of my favorite red wines but recently over the last couple of months I've gotten into seriously old dirt by Villafonte now this is a slightly more pricier wine but there we go that's what it looks like it's a slightly slightly pricier wine but it's phenomenal Whew, I don't even drink it every day because cha you know, this one you have to open up when, like, I've got three of the, the bottles in my house right now. But you gotta open them up on a day where you feel like, yo, hi. Hi. Or on a day where you're just like, hi. <laughs> or on a day, you know, where you're like really happy or you're really stressed out and you need a drink because you are in so much shock. It's those kinds of days where you open up a bottle like this, okay? Where you're celebrating something or where you're having a really good piece of steak, like a T-bone or, or a sirloin or veal or whatever. If you're having something like that, pull up this baby. I really, really love it. Um, yeah, I'm a big fan of, of uh, Villa Fonte wines. Very big fan. And then the last item is gin now i think i have <laughs> shown this gin in one of my vlogs i'm pretty sure i was preparing the gin because i remember somebody asked in the comments what gin is that this is aviation gin. there we go that's aviation gin okay this is aviation gin i had no idea and no clue about this gin the backstory about this gin is that uh, my partner and i are alcohol drinkers <laughs> We're alcohol drinkers, but not only that, not, not in that way. Um, I'm a gin drinker and I'm also a fan of Ryan Reynolds. And so when we started hanging out quite a lot, not Ryan Reynolds and I, I wish, I wish, not Ryan and I, but when my partner and I started hanging out quite a bit, he then told me, he was like, do you know that Ryan has a gin? And I'm like, he's got a gin? He's like, yeah, he's got a gin. You seen gins, this gin pop up in some of his movies. I'm like, no, I had no idea. Then he got me the gin and I was like, smooth. If you think that uh, Tanqueray number 10 is a smooth drink, whatever, sure. It's a great gin. It's a great gin and I still drink it. I was having a glass yesterday. If you think number 10 is a smooth drink, whatever, whatever, this one is smoother and it's more subtle. Hairas, it's not pungent on the lips, yo, on the tongue, yo. It is so, so good. A little bit more pricier than number 10. By a couple of, a couple of, t uh, I think number 10 is probably like 420. This one is maybe like 450. If you buy it on Take A Lot, it's about 500, 529, obviously for shipping and things like that. But you don't find it everywhere, so if you do find it, grab it. Because it's a really, really great, great, great bottle of gin. And that's pretty much it. Those are my 2021 lifestyle favorites. Those are my 2021 lifestyle favorites. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is the third video that I'm filming today. I'm really, really proud of myself. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you did, please click the like button 
a, a button please if we could get us to more than a thousand likes per video it helps me so so much guys and i'm thanking all of you who have ensured that that happens i really appreciate it and uh subscribe to the channel and click that bell so that you know the next time i upload until then i'll see you in the next video <laughs> bye sayonara